Hey guys, let's do a get ready with me. Let's do a get ready with me. This is going to be a five minute, well it depends on how bad my OCD is. <laughs> um, we'll see how long it takes, but this is my everyday makeup routine. I'm going to tell you products, I'm going to walk you through how I would apply them to my face every single day, so let's just do it. Usually when I do these, I don't tell products and I ramble way too much. <laughs> So most of this stuff is going to be actually Maybelline, my number one favorite. Elf is a good one too. I do love Elf products. So I believe this, yes it says right here, it's in the color blush and it's the Maybelline New York Fit Me type of blush in blush. <laughs> so I'm not doing the base of my face, which is foundation. I haven't been doing that recently of late. So I'm doing this on my cheeks, and I'm covering my whole entire cheek. I'm going around with this MAC brush. I don't even know what one it is. It's so old. It's so worn. But I'm just going around in circles, and then I go up with a back and forth type of movement to whatever body part this is called. <laughs> Sounds so smart right now. Um, basically going up at a slight slant. Like a little swoosh, I guess. Next, we're going to do Revolution Highlight. This is in Dare to Divulge. I think that's how you pronounce it. I hate those words where they, where they, where they can be pronounced in another way. It's kind of confusing. This I'm putting over top, the very top line of where the blush was. So like that. We have blush on the bottom going up and out. And then... Um, I'm making a video, but sure. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Where was I? Um, yeah. So that was the highlight. I didn't get into highlight until maybe a year ago. I didn't really get into it. And that's probably my favorite part about makeup. That and blush is a lot of fun. And then... Can I get any garbage? No, I already have it. Oh, sorry. Okay. Please close it. <laughs> and then this, um, it's so worn and so old, I no longer have the info on what it is, but I think it's called seashell or something shell. It's a very pale pink kind of color. That is going on top of my lids. And there's a fly behind you, by the way, in the windowsill. Very fun. He's behind the blind. He's trying to escape and not very good at it. <laughs> but, yeah. So as you can see, I'm not doing things like... I don't know, concealer or contour or primer. I'm not using the fancy items, <laughs> you know? This one I forget, <sighs> what's it called? It's their bright white. This I'm gonna put on my inner corners. This used to be a favorite part of my makeup too. I just love the bright glowy look. And I think this is so pretty. It really makes your eyes pop. Blush is just like a girly look. And then all of the bright, the brightening and highlighting type of stuff, that is just like fairy, pixie, or mermaid nymph or something, you know? So there's that. And now I'm going to get into eyes. And here we have a liquid eyeliner. This is Master Precise All Day in black. Usually I do blackest black for mascara, by the way. Okay. And sometimes, <laughs> words, some days I'm really good at it, other days I'm not, and I think today is one of those is not days. We'll see. I'll speed it up here. <laughs> and I messed up. And I do that too, I use my saliva, that's a part of the routine. Yep.
trick also is to close your eyes and compare how the line goes. I do a lot of that. This is also a how not to do. <laughs> This is just how one chaotic girl <laughs> does her, her makeup, you know. And then this is Lash Sensational Full Fan Effect. And, oh, it's too small to read. Looks like so. Where are we going? Okay. I remember in middle school, around the time when I first started to wear some makeup to school and out of the house, you know, I really wanted to look perfect and I had it all wrong. I would go to my locker on like a bathroom break in the eighth grade just to touch up my makeup, like my foundation and my blush. That was me. you know, trying to look good for everybody in the world, you know, I did not have it right. And then also to check how the lashes look off to the side, I go like this, where I turn my head and I have my hand out against my face like this, and I can kind of see how spidery they look, I guess. And I'll just do some touch-ups. So there's that. And then this part, another fun part, is the lips. So here we have Maybelline Cherry Me. And then here we have MAC Twig. I'm going to do Twig first. And this is like a pinky brown. This is like a watermelon red. Okay, put it over the top. So this makes it not as dry. I'm not saying that this is dry. This is very kind of creamy. But this feels more like a moisturizing effect. So yeah, and that would be the look, and then I would get out of these clothes, even though this is pretty adorable, I must say so. Am I right? Is it so? Yes, it's so adorable. <laughs> um, hair washed it today, just an hour or two ago, and I'm going to leave it down and my natural curl. So that would be the look.